Hi everybody, it's Renee, um, Presley Fever VSG Journey. Um, today is uh, nine weeks post-op, and um, it's been a really long week. Um, work has been ridiculous. I've been working crazy amounts of overtime, and um, on call, mandated time, that kind of stuff. Um, so this past week, um, I wasn't the best behaved. I didn't um, find time to work out. Um, I ate okay. So numbers, um, pre-op high was 329, date of surgery was 311.7. Um, last week, I'm just checking my notes because I can't remember, sorry. Last week I was 269.8 uh, um, and today I was 265.9, so another 3.9 loss even though I didn't exercise other than parking my car farther away when I was at the store. Um, for a total of 64.1 since my all them high and 46.7 since surgery in nine weeks, which is fantastic. And I am beyond happy. I'm shopping um, and I am um, fitting in things that didn't fit before. And people are noticing like, wow, look at you, you're getting skinny, which feels great. Um, but like I said, I'm really having a tough time this week because a part of the reason I, I did this whole route to surgery was to give myself the tools I needed to be successful to get healthy. I turned 40 this year, um, fat 40, fabulous, but, um, so I want to have a healthier life and my job is stressing me out right now and I love my job. I love my patients. I love the people I work with. Um, but there's some crappy situations and I'm trying to decide if it's worth sticking it out for a few months. Look at my mascara. Um, and sacrificing myself, maybe my sanity, my health, or if it's time to start looking for a new job. So, yeah. And, uh fly. Um, daylight savings time. I live in the Northeast, so we set the clocks back. It is 425 and it's the sun is setting. So that's hard to deal with too. Um, I'm not a gym person. I don't like the gym. Uh, and I always used to be able to justify that if I got on walked, I don't need to go to the gym. Now it's going to be dark when I get home from work and I'm going to have to go to the gym. Um, I gotta find a gym buddy, uh, locally to motivate me, maybe one of the girls from work. So that's the scoop. Um, yeah, it's just been kind of a bummer of a weekend. Like I said, I worked all weekend, um, a lot of death patients, that's what I do, but, um, some of my favorite patients died over the weekend and I found out an old friend from high school, um, passed and... We hadn't kept in touch, and I feel bad about that, and I'll never get to see her. So, yeah, kind of a gloomy, doomy week and update. So sorry about that. I am going to work on trying to be more cheerful next week. I am going to try and work on finding more time for me, um, for me to exercise and um, that kind of stuff, because it's important. And... <laughs> I finally figured out I'm such a dope I do everything on my iPhone I live on my iPhone um, I finally pulled out my laptop and I figured out that I can edit videos on YouTube so I am going to try and edit some videos with some fun bling and stuff um, to make things a little bit more interesting so I hope everybody else is doing great keep up the good work um, I spent a lot of time in what little spare time I had this weekend, watching videos of newbies, pre-ops, um, subscribe to some new people, really interesting stuff. Uh, if you're pre-op, hang in there. If you're just new post-op, hang in there. And if you're eight, nine weeks, hang in there. I should take my own advice. So, um, happy Halloween, happy November, and um, I'll see you guys all next week. Take care.